What up? Uh, welcome to our channel, The Average Gym Bros. I'm Derek. Uh, Fernando. Uh, a little bit about me. Basically, I'm trying to get this fitness game. Uh, I want to be a police officer, hopefully in the next year or two. Um, trying to get in shape for the physical part, um, you know. My goal is to um, drop at least 25 to 30 pounds in the next year and a half. Um, one, you know, so I'm struggling the physical. Two, you know, then wrong looking good, right? Yeah, hell yeah. Around <laughs> you know, I'm doing the, you know, the man booze, whatnot. Really on <laughs> <laughs> so, so basically, that's where we at right now. Um, what the thing is, uh, Fernando basically came to me. Was like, Derek, you know, I know you start working out, and yeah, I know. And I did it started last year in November of 2015. And I was like, hey, maybe I should start, you know, this gym thing. On and off for a while, found a little steady routine between February of 2016. Between until about April of 2016, I lost about you know five to six pounds. You know, I was doing good. You know, but along the way, work got crazy. Short staff, my 40 hours turned into 56. It went up. Um, try to do it, but I know people say there's an excuse if you really want to go get it, but like you know, working that many hours, you know, what I mean, it gets to you know. And Fernando came and like boom, found something that worked for me. I want to introduce you to it. I want to help you reach your goals. And I'm like, first I was like, yeah, bruh, you know, fuck that. I don't know. I mean, I was like, <laughs> I'm lazy. You know what I mean? I don't do that shit. You know, I drink some Monster Red Bull, play some PS4. But, you know, I'm getting older and everything. And I just thought maybe it's time I should take care of myself. And, yeah, that's me, bro. Yeah, man, always take care of yourself. Uh, hey, I'm Fernando. And um, I started intermittent fasting, you know, probably a year ago on and off. Uh, my previous job was a lot harder physically on me, so I couldn't really maintain it. My hours were crazy, just like his. Yeah, dishwasher and um, and uh, custodial and maintenance supervisor. Supervisor. Sucked, man. It sucked. And the pay was not necessarily. Well, that's how we met, though. That's how yeah. we met. That is how we met. Shout out to Amy for introducing us. What's up, Rico? Yo, Amy. Like the video. <laughs> the, yeah. Subscribe, you know. Yeah. That good stuff. Um, but yeah, I was working in that uh, not very nice environment to start intermittent fasting it is a you know culinary school food was around me all the time and not necessarily the best place to be at when you're intermittent fasting and you're hungry and food. you work odd hours food is wrong with that right food everywhere i mean it's good but moderation of course um but i did, didn't necessarily have the control over uh, <laughs> how much i hate when I did, especially if it was a good night, you know, when they make those good dinners. <laughs> those great dinners, though. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, get him to stick my fucking plate, and then he had a plate and takes it home, which he shouldn't, but hey, what the fuck, you know? You make a little to go <laughs> box. <laughs> to go box. For, for the snack on the way right, home. Right, I was security. <laughs> I was supposed to make sure he takes you out of the building, though, but I'm like, food was so good, you can't keep it inside. Like, you know? everybody would do it. Why yeah. not? You know what I mean? But yeah, I mean, uh, then I transitioned on to security as well at another location. Not there, sadly. Uh, but it, is it really sadly? Or you know, who's get the fuck out of that place? A little bit of both. <laughs> I'm just talking about the people that okay. I miss. But you know, uh, working security, i would never done it before. You know, uh, it's a lot more laid back. At least where I'm at, I'm able to actually uh, focus on fasting, and I'll fast for about 18 to sometimes even 24 hours. And I get my workout in in the morning, first thing in the morning. I usually go at 4 in the morning, maybe 5. Yeah. She's do Snapchat, bro. I'm at the gym at 2 o'clock in the fucking morning. Fuck the gym at 2 o'clock in the morning. When I go at 2 in the morning, it's because I have I have overtime that day. So I'll sleep early, go at 2 in the morning, go to work at 4. Well, I'm not going to lie. I go to the gym at 4.30 in the morning because there's no one there. You can get a proper lift. You can get a proper workout, you know. It's, you know. But when you go, like, in the daytime, shit. Yeah. Dang, yeah. True that. So, uh you know, I was able to actually start working out consistently over the past three to four months. Go, been going six, even seven days sometimes a week. Um, no days off. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I did read that I do need a day off or two, you know. So I do have a day off. Uh, sometimes I actually do two a day now, where I'll go in the morning and then in the evening. Did that for a while, too, as well. Myself, lost a job. I started dropping a lot more, but once again, one for the work. Yeah, well, I mean, work is a, uh, you do um, tend to, you know, even if it's not hard labor, you know, the sleeping. Sleeping is part of, you know, the, the, the system of, you know, losing weight and gaining muscle. You need to sleep, you need to eat nutrition, uh, right? Yeah, you need to, you know, 
Go ahead, go ahead. Don't want to worry about me. Go ahead. Uh, <laughs> I thought we were dying on me over there. the holiday. Um, but yeah. Um, you know, I've been doing this for consistently for the past few months, and uh, it's been working out for me. I've lost 30 pounds. 30 pounds. <laughs> and I'm also yeah. trying to, uh, you know, do the police academy or, um, you know, or even highway patrol. Maybe I could test into that. But. I want to drive around. Mess with people. Give them that VC, man. You know, I pulled you over. Da, 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 da. You know what I mean? You don't want to do that. Nah, come on. You know, we <laughs> want to do it for the right reasons. Right. Absolutely for the right reasons. You know. We um, need more minorities in the police departments. That I agree with. Yeah, so 30 pounds. I want to go into the police academy or anything law enforcement related, but yeah. again, you got to be healthy, fit, get on top of your stuff, book wise as well. Um, yeah. Also, on top of uh, posting our top of the police academy, um, I actually, you know, I, I need to start studying for everything too. I mean, physical is one part of it, and you know, mental, you know, you need that too. You need the, that written test. Yeah, you know what I mean. That's smart. Yeah. yeah. Kick your foot. You don't play footsies. <laughs> but, <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm trying to do that, and uh, you know, uh, I'm, I'm here with him too. So. Um, Basically, you guys are going to follow me and follow him. And basically, I'm going to show my progress as I just slowly shred you know, as much as I can for the next year and a half. Hopefully, um, you guys watch your vlog. Um, you know, I know there's going to be a lot of people saying, oh, you guys are stupid. You guys don't know about fitness. And that's fine, you know. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion. Um, it's okay. We welcome internet trolls. That's why I make life funny, right? Yeah. They're going to be some 14-year-old kid or some freaking gym douchebag who's going to be like, you guys don't know anything. The black dude shit is fat ass now. But whatever, you know. If that's make you feel good about yourself, rock on, dude. You know what I mean? <laughs> Remember, everybody starts off somewhere. You're right. And uh, we're going to make progress, uh, you know, slowly but surely because, uh, I mean, I'd rather go at a steady pace than overtrain. And uh, I'm going to help him along the way. And um, also, uh, I decided to go into boxing. And uh, my coworker, she... Yeah, you're probably up all right in boxing. That's nah, fine. Nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, too much MMA, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I used to be training for MMA, but I was not conditioned enough at the time. So mm -hmm. I'm going to take on boxing. My coworker, she is uh, no longer in competition. But she does keep training, and she actually participated in the um, Junior Olympics a couple years ago when she was, yeah, Rodriguez. Far out, far out, far out yeah. Average? Huh? That's average? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, she still keeps training, and um, she's going to train me, and I'm going to train with her coach. Uh, I am a beginner in boxing, so I'll be posting some videos. And again, there's probably going to be some trolls. Right. But I gotta do it. I'm gonna try and cut to 185, 185. and then see where I can go from there. I might, you know, do What's light that? heavyweight. Light, okay, light yeah. heavyweight. Maybe drop a little more. I've never been under 200 pounds when I did uh, lose weight when I was in high school. Uh, but yeah, stay tuned for all that. And uh, this is the average gym bros signing out, guys. Fire out, bro. Take it easy.